How's it going everybody? Shockwave984 here and today is going to be part 2 of my anime and manga haul for January and it's going to be uh, 13 items total and with that let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first up we have Jing King of Bandits and this is an old uh, Tokyo Pop release and uh, man, yeah they just happened to get this is volume one, the nice shiny right there. Uh, they happen to get all seven volumes uh, used, and uh, the place I usually go to, and man, that was just awesome, yeah. This is one I've been looking for for quite a while. There we go. Along with the anime as well, because uh, along with this, they're both long out of print. Um, Hoping one day it'll get a re-release. Uh, if not the manga, maybe the anime, or hopefully both. Uh, but yeah, uh, I remember seeing previews uh, for the show for this uh, all over, <laughs> all over the place. Sorry about that. There we go. So this is to show a little bit of the art here. And the world of Jing, it's it's interesting. <laughs> it is very out there. There's a lot of like weird stuff happening. Um, there's also a theme with um, like drinks, like drinking and stuff. Like a uh, a sand whale. There we go. Yeah, and it's they're using a carrot. <laughs> That's what it looks like. There we go. And uh, this is a cool shot right here. So there we go. And yeah, so like the the chapters are called uh, shots. So this would be the first shot there. There we go. First chapter. Yes, epic looking shot right there. And um, yeah, this is one I've been looking for for quite a while. I, I did find a few of these volumes. I think like the first three or four of them on um, Right Stuff. And uh, there's also a sequel manga series called, uh, I believe it's Twilight Tales. And uh, I believe it's just a continuation of this as far as I, I can um, tell. So uh, there we go. So here is volume two. And they all got this nice like sheen to them. You got the numbers nice and big there. There we go. These covers are awesome really cool so all seven of the uh, original series and the sequel is also seven volumes there we go here is volume three there we go so yeah uh, I just remember seeing a lot of uh, previews for the uh, the show for this and it always looked pretty uh, interesting but just um just never picked it up, um, I mean, because there was a lot of other stuff out at the time. <laughs> there we go. That's pretty cool. And here is volume five. There we go. So yeah, I uh, found these all used, um, and they're still pretty good shape. Uh, yeah, just, they just happened to uh, get some more used uh, manga in, and this happened to be right there. So, yeah. There we go. There's volume six. There we go. And here is volume seven. There we go. So that completes the original uh, run of the series. So yeah, there is a sequel. And uh, I believe you can also find me a couple of volumes of it on, um, I believe also on Right Stuff. And then uh, you could probably find these on Amazon and stuff too. Probably just around. There we go. All right. And Next up, we have the last three volumes of Dead Man Wonderland. So here is volume 11. 
There we go. That's a nice cover right there. And these, uh, there happened to be a sale. I'm not sure if it's going on on a, uh, sorry, at a Barnes and Noble. You can get, uh, you buy two and then get the third one free. So, uh, yeah, just happened to, uh, catch that. So, uh, I'm not sure if it's still going at the moment. So, there we go. Here's the back. So, yeah, another completed series. Uh, very happy to, uh, complete it finally. Uh, we don't have the anime still. Here's volume 12. Um, we might pick it up, um, this one day. I think you can get it for pretty cheap. So, there we go. Here's the back. There we go. And then finally, volume 13. So that completes Dead Man Wonderland. There we go. And, yep, there you see, final volume. There we go, and it looks pretty funny. <laughs> Alright, and that does it for the manga. And let's go ahead and get into the anime. So, first up we have, and uh, so these are, uh, uh, along with uh, Jing, uh, King of Bandits, all the anime is used. And this is an old one I used to, uh, or excuse me, I've seen, uh, man, years and years ago. Uh, three by Three Eyes, or I believe this is called Eyes, is the original name. And this is old, uh, this is a Pioneer release. There we go. This is a collector's edition. So yeah, I happen to find this, and I, I recognize it, but I just haven't seen it in a very long time. There we go. But I do remember finding, I think, individual DVD releases for it. I believe it's like one or two. There we go. So this is a series of OVAs. So there we go. Let me see if I can get it to clear up. There we go. There we go. So you have uh, one is uh, one disc is Immortals, and that's what it consists of. And then you have Legend of the Divine Demon. There we go. And yeah, so this is the complete series here. And this collection is pretty neat. So uh, uh, let me show a little uh, pamphlet here. And then this gives you all the episodes. That's for Immortals. Little picture there. And then here is for Legend of the Divine Demon. There we go. And you also get... Um, actually, surprise, this is still in here. Uh, you actually get a little, uh, like, temporary tattoos. There we go. You get, like, an eye... There's a title right there. So that's really cool. Or I think they're stickered. No, I want to say they're temporary tattoos. So, there we go. And the discs, the discs are pretty cool. So here is the first one. That's really neat. And then here is the second one. Let's see if you guys can see that okay. There we go. Oh, that back in there. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, very happy to have that. And next up we have. Oh, there we go. And uh, okay, so next up we have uh, Hakuge or Hakugi Legend of the Moby Dick collection. Yes, there's an anime based on Moby Dick. <laughs> that whole story. And uh, this is the complete series here. 
see some characters. Let me see if I can get it to clear. There we go. There it goes. Okay. Characters right there on the bottom. And uh, this is a clear case. Um, I, this is an ADV release. I want to say there was also a black one. So there we go. See some of the characters there. That's really cool. And here is the back. And yeah, so it is done in a space opera. It's pretty interesting. And uh, I happen to see this around or see previews of it uh, quite a bit. And uh, but just have it checked it out. And I uh, just happened to find um, this all together. So uh, yeah, so here you go. 26 episodes. Get a nice uh, set of extras there. And then you also get some pretty nice screenshots here there we go alright let's go ahead and open this up and this is a uh, what is it six uh, s sorry six disc set there we go and uh, the art on the covers is really nice. So here we go. So there's disc one. There's disc two. There's three. Here is four. Yeah, these are just really nice. I really like how they did this. Here's five. And here is six. It's a really nice set. Oh, oh, sorry about that. <laughs> so there we go. And then last up, stay together. There we go. Tenchi Muyo GXP Galaxy Police Transporter. This is the Viridian uh, Collection. So this is the complete series. There we go. I happen to find this um, at another place I usually go to, and yeah, you can see it's kind of beat up there. And this is a old um, Digipack collection. So there we go. Here's the spine there. Yeah. <laughs> so here's the back. There we go. There you see a story summary there. Get a few screenshots. Let it clear up. There we go. So eight disc and uh, it's twenty uh, six episodes. So special features. There's some more pictures there. There's one right there. Uh, yeah, need some help, man. <laughs> so uh, here we go. And uh, this uh, series is available in a, uh, I believe it's a save edition. I want to say there was a regular case edition as well before that one also. So there we go. And uh, there is something, um, it could be considered maybe a bad thing about this set. So you go ahead and open it up here and you do get some nice pictures there we go and here's the thing with this set they're in little paper sleeves so it could be considered kind of as if it's like a bad thing um, so here you have the episodes that are on the disc because you have to be really careful on how you get these out so you just kind of like push down and go underneath and then like slide it out um, but they are they are in there pretty securely so that's good there we go you see episodes there so that's disc two and three 
here is disk four and disk five. Oh, I don't think I mentioned it. I apologize for the lighting. It's kind of clearing up and then it's raining again and then it's clearing up again. So yeah, there we go. There we go. So the episodes there. There's disc six or disc six. There we go. There is number seven. And here is number eight. So Tenchi Muyo, uh, I really enjoy the series. I fondly remember it from uh, Toonami. And I uh, used to watch it all the time when it was on. And uh, now this one I have not seen. I've seen like clips of it and stuff. There we go. So here's the last picture. And uh, but yeah, I was like, oh, they made another Tenchi Mulio. So uh, yeah, because there's a lot to this uh, just franchise. There's a lot. <laughs> so uh, yeah, very excited to uh, check this one out. There we go. So overall, this set is really nice, but it's just that you have to be really careful because they're in sleeves. So, and also this is, um, it's not very, you know, because it's bent out of shape, so it slides out pretty easily. I think I'll put some at the bottom and the top to help keep it in place. So, uh, yeah, there we go. And with that, let's go ahead and turn these guys around. Oh, you see Sherlock and Jack Sparrow there. So uh, with that, that just about does it for uh, this video. So like the video if you do, subscribe if you like, and I'll see you guys next time.